So as you can see, the car is in a distressed state. It's zero percent, or zero PSI, I should say. We're low on fuel. We've driven approximately uh, 50 miles since when the tire blew this morning. Uh, we're probably crossing the 50 mile mark right now as we speak. And uh, just traveling along at 60, you know, 70 miles per hour. Front right tire is completely flat. These are on the carbon fiber wheels. So we're putting the, uh, the run flats to the test. Now granted this morning we were only running about 45, which is about half that 50 miles. And then the other half the 50 miles we've been traveling about this 70 miles per hour or so. And so uh, I'm hoping, see I've got another front wheel and front tire already mounted, ready to go. I bought a set of um, wheels and tires and uh, the front left one, one of the front wheels I broke twice and then the other one I, I haven't broke once. And so the one that I haven't broke once, that's got the old original tire. So it's got a 34,000 mile tire on it. So that's why it's now worn out and the other three are fine because the other three tires are all newer tires. So I was waiting for that one to go bad and usually I, I go ahead and replace them all at the same time, but my luck, I was like, if I replace it, I'm liable to crack my, uh, my other wheel and I'd rather not have to mount and dismount this other tire. I'd rather use this tire up and see if I coincidentally crack this wheel while I'm using this tire up. So I knew this tire was gonna eventually blow. So the lesson here is, you guys know how fast I drive cars. I got 34,000 miles out of a set of tires on a C8 Z06, you see? Uh, because I run 34, 35, 36 PSI. Uh, when the tires are warm, when I'm driving down the road. Um, the reason why the back tires are so full right now is because the one back wheel is cracked. It's got a slow leak in it. Actually, I think both back wheels are cracked and they have slow leaks. And uh, so that's why I've got extra pressure in the, in the back wheels right now is just so I don't have to fill them up every day. I fill them up every three days or so. So anyway, just giving you guys some transparency to... Uh, why these run flat tires are nice, but you can only go about 50 miles on them before they will come off the bead. So we're really gonna be pushing it. I really don't wanna tear up this carbon fiber wheel, but I also don't wanna fuck around with anything. And so since I'm just driving straight down a Florida highway, it's not a, uh, it's not a big drama as far as the uh, longevity of the tire. I think I'm gonna make it. We'll see if I jinx myself or not, but uh, either way, we're. We'll find out soon. Figured I'd just document what's going on. All right, see ya.